Okay, so hey everybody, so welcome to a new video, and today we're going to be doing a tutorial on how to be good at Mario Kart Wii. So, here, film me real quick. This is what I use, a classic controller. Wow, looks like a bar of soap. It really does. <laughs> and if you want to get the classic controller pro, it looks kind of like an Xbox controller. Uh, I think it looks like a GameCube uh, controller in here. a way. This, the Wii Remote by itself. Wow! Is, um... Oh, don't forget about the Wii Wheel. <laughs> the Wii Wheel is arguably the worst controller you could use. If you pl Most people just use it for a joke, but it's arguably the worst controller you can use. See, it's, it's, it's the worst. It's arguably the worst controller to use. Well, I, I mean, I still use, like, I, I use the Wii Remote, but the, the Wii Wheel is just kind of okay. stupid. I don't know why it's it, bad. The second best controller bad. to use is... In your opinion, it's, it's kind of... Ah, yes. And that's good for using. Just because it's more precise. You don't have to use tilt controls. Use the joystick. I like tilt controls, though. It feels more familiar to me. But I honestly think that the... that the If I were to rank the controllers, I would say that... The nunchuck the, the, is the, one of the, the best. The, the Wii Classic controller. Like, I don't and know, the if nunchuck. You have tiers, like S tier, A tier, all that. Um, let's see, though. S tier. The, the, game, the GameCube Shit controller... Tier. And um, the Wii Classic controller are the best. They're in S tier. Ah, yes. Um, the Nunchuck is in B tier, I'd say. And the Wii Wheel is all the way down at the bottom in F tier. <laughs> well. And, I don't know, I'll just should be showing you, like, I don't know, five or... Should I just do it in time trials or some races? What do you think? Uh, I, I want to do... I want to have them do races so then they can okay, races, see right? the brutality. I mean, a what? Shushka. Yeah, not so ace be eight. Doing four races today. <laughs> not eight. <laughs> and okay, so I'll show you what the best like medium weight characters you can use. Well, Daisy the funny is the best thing is, they're all weight rows. character. All right. Yeah. Daisy, she gives the best speed. Although she's she annoying. Yeah, she is very very annoying. But like, she gives the best speed. So they're all characters who have, have hidden stats. She gives a plus four speed bonus. So if you want to use Daisy as your medium weight, then that's the plus best. four charisma. And then um, Luigi is also really good because he gives a plus three mini turbo bonus. Ah, well the funny thing is they're a couple. Dun, dun, funny, dun, yeah. dun, dun, dun. And then I think Baby Daisy and Baby Luigi have the same thing. Yoshi he gives a plus three speed bonus and a plus five, and he gives a plus five mini turbo bonus. Cool. So he's one of the best. He's one of the good medium weight characters too. And then for the heavyweight, Funky Kong is arguably the best heavyweight character. Agreed. And he's also radical, so yes. He gives, <laughs> His he shirt gives looks like it's painted speed on. Bonus, His... And he gives a plus two mini turbo bonus. But that doesn't sound very good, but compared with the best vehicles in the game, that's why. Dry well, Bowser like gives a plus yeah. three speed bonus, but a plus seven mini turbo bonus. You sound like a nerd, so but I know what you're awesome, talking about, so though. I'm just, <laughs> you sound know, like a nerd. Funky Kong is one, and I'll show you what the best vehicles are, so. You want to ignore all these carts. Standard cart, nobody uses that. Off-road or Flame Flyer, Prana Prowler, Jet Set, or Honey Coop. Horrible. Don't use that. It doesn't even look like it fits the Flame character. Runner. The best characters for a large weight are Flame Runner because it has a stat called Inside Drift. When you turn, it's turning towards the racetrack, and Outside Drift is, I don't know, so it's really bad. So bad. The Flame <laughs> Runner is the best vehicle for heavyweights. It's also the best vehicle in the game. This, one of the other good vehicles for heavyweights is the spear. It has the it's the fastest vehicle in the game. But doesn't have the but best all the other um, stats are turning. Really average. <laughs> so for medium weights, the the vehicles Ooh. with inside drift are the mock bike, the sneakster. It's a weird and sounding the one. And dasher. So there's three for that. And all these carts are just terrible. You don't want to use carts ever. If you use carts, then you deserve to be Mer set on fire. brutal. You deserve to be blue shelled. You deserve to set on fire. Now blue shelled. Um, let's see. The For quacker. The best vehicles that are that are quacker. that are little weights. So the bullet bike is the best vehicle for for light weights. It looks derpy the though. The quacker <laughs> is the worst only because it has, it's pretty good. It has some good stats, but it's also very slow and very light. And it so and one bump it's gone. One bump you're just send off the race track. The Magic Cruiser is also very good because it has Looks great, great off-road, and if you use it with Toadette, she gives the best off-road bonus in the game. Except so, she's annoying. So tracks like, um, Sherbert Land and... 
Shy Guy Beach are good, but the rest are not. Then the Jet Bubble is also pretty good, but it has a lot of average stats. So I'm just showing off the inside drifting vehicles, which are only nine. But today I'm just going to be showing Funky Kong with the Flame Runner. Funky Kong's pants and shirt look like they're and painted know, on. It's going to pick four random tracks for me just because, and I know just about every one of these tracks. Bowser Castle 3, that's a good one. It looks more like the path to the castle. But anyway, yeah, what you want to do it's is not more here, you can to the TV so we can see. When it counts and when it's at 2, then you want to hold the button and it gives you a slight boost. And if you press and the would up be button really on the good. classic controller, you can wheelie. And what I'm doing right now is if you press R on the classic controller and then turn, you're drifting, inside drift. And then here, look at what I'm doing right now. I stopped and I'm moving him slightly. When he stopped, get out of the way, Womp, to give it a standstill mini turbo. That's what I'm giving right Although now. Although it does take a while to, it, to no, it, it do, takes though. Shorter, it only took a while to charge because I was showing it off. And right now yeah. I'm a star, so you can also do tricks. Whee! And here. also almost fall off. And... <laughs> well, Bowser went fine. And when you press the... If you press left, right, down, or up... On the classic. On the classic controller, you get tricks. You can just shake your shake your Wii remote for the, for the nunchuck and the Wii wheel. Well, the Wii remote feels right. more classic with me, though. Yeah, you like the it, Wii remote. I mean, yeah, I it, it just feels it just feels just the original. Goods. Currently, I'm just you drifting and pressing it. up for wheelie. You can also press left or right. That works too. Did you see what Down happened to his card? To really oh. weird. I just you can also press R to hop. Right now, it just looks like Funky Kong with good ants in his pants. But <laughs> you hop and stuff, and that's just something you can do. So turning, you always drift. You and should, anyways, um, um, unless it's like mini, a really tight turn. Instead. Yeah, right now I just got crushed, so I can do a standstill mini turbo right now. And, and um, I'm sort of playing badly, honestly, just to show off a lot of the things I want to show off. You should have done that in time trials, now that I really think. Yeah, but then there's power ups. Why is our house phone ringing? Who is calling? No one cares. I'm gonna again, so. I'm gonna use this left, right, down. Toll free call, this is who we're getting a call from. Eh, that's not so much of a surprise. Yeah. yeah, you can trick and stuff, and use the mushrooms to get ahead a lot, honestly. And right now, I'm just not even... King there. Mushroom's also very King good. King Mushroom, the Golden Mushroom, is also really good. I'm gonna definitely get a first place on this, because the Flame Runner is the best vehicle in the game. No, unless you don't use it well. And, yeah, you can also use red shells to throw them directly at somebody. They're literally like heat seeking They're literally heat-sinking missiles. Red shells. Um, and green Yeet shells seeking. and banana peels, single banana peels. Speak of the devil. To place traps, like, or also if you hold L, you can hold it behind you, and Funky Kong will drag it like a blanket. <laughs> yeah. And, oh, some guy just ran into my banana peel, so he just got slipped up and messed up. Oh, and you're forgetting about if you hold a uh, uh, bananas behind you, behind you. Oh, I just got a worst item, a thunder cloud. If you get a thunder cloud. Honestly, what you can do is just bump somebody. Like, let's see, on the dry bones right here, just bump. <laughs> I reversed. By That's the him. Button. I slowly s slowed down a little bit and pressed the reverse button. That's B on the classic controller in GameCube, and then on the nunchuck, I believe it's also B, and then on the Wii wheel, it's one. It's the one button. So yeah, right now, like whenever there's straight paths, oops, I'm drifting. No, whenever there's straight paths, I'm wheeling. I don't think that's a word. <laughs> I don't think it is either. I press the F button, or the left button, or the right button, but I just always press the left. First place! And I just got first. You can also use fake item blocks to... The, the, fa the face place. of a happy man. No, I want to film your butt. Well, don't film my butt. Fine. This Wait, you not got pants on? happy man, see? I am Cardinalia! And this is the face of a strange man. <laughs> But anyway, if I'm able to get, Bruh. like, further ahead or whatever, I'll be able to show you some things, like, possibly a blue shell dodge. Ooh. I might be able to show Or blue that. shells. And I can also do shortcuts on Super Nintendo Ghost Valley. Yeah, there's only I one. Super Nintendo Ghost Valley, even though people are like, it's SNES. 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 What I'm saying is... SNES. Like, right, I think, like, a second after Lakitu says two... Then, and that's when you hold the button to do your thing, to get a boost. Oh, also, watch that. Right Boom. after you get a boost, you do a wheelie, so that you get maximum speed. You sound like a nerd, but I know what you're talking about. You do know what I'm talking about. I'm just trying to teach Not people really. who have, like, never played this game before. Oh, also, don't forget about the like, bananas. Well, how, how oh, don't forget about the bananas. How to Mario Kart Wii for dummies. I want to call this video <laughs> that or something. <laughs> but anyway, yeah, the bananas... Hey, are you I insulting the viewers? I want the viewers. Traps, like, throw them behind you. You press, you press the L button... 
Oh, wait, don't forget about using them to block um, red shells. You can yeah, use you that can. to block a red shell. block red shells. If a green shell is behind you, it's going to hit you. you can... Oh, look, look, somebody's left a star here. What the heck? Maybe they got powered or something. I don't know. I don't... Yeah, also, yeah, right now I'm just holding L. Well, speak of the devil, there's a red shell. Yeah, that, that blue shell. Ran at One shell, two shell, red shells, blue shells. I just did a standstill mini turbo. That's what I'm doing when I, like, lose speed because of whatever. And, um... You do a standstill mini turbo, which is like you stop, you hold A and R at the same time, and also wiggle the joystick slightly. Ink! Oh, don't forget about the bomb. Try and get. Look what I did. I just did a <laughs> joke where I crossed the fence and uh, fell off. I was just being funny there. That his face is literally. Good. I just his did face that is like. Funny. Yeah. And Funky Kong just opened his mouth like this. <laughs> if anybody didn't know, Funky Kong is actually Donkey Kong's younger cousin, which is really cool. Younger? I thought he was older. No, he's younger. I think Youngster. Like Donkey Kong's supposed to be like twenty something. Funky old. Let's like say like old. Or I really don't know. Let's say old. This old is the best square. description. It also has a lot of um things you can do. Well, I was thinking about this like one actually. This stuff like right here. Really you're is. Turning, and when you get the blue sparks behind you, that's a mini turbo, and it gives you propels you slightly faster. Until you hit a wall. And I'm doing a standstill mini turbo. When you see me. At, Hit a wall or something. Oh, look. There, I just demonstrated it. Red, red shell, shell blocking. blocking. Red shell blocking, yes. This one has a lot of turns you can do, so what you do is just hold R, and then use the joystick to turn. And for Wii Wheel, it's 2 for acceleration. Nunchuck, it's A. GameCube controller, I'm 90% sure it's the same thing. You can also drag fake item blocks behind you, but it's not really useful, though. Unless there's, like, unless someone there's right on your tail. You. Yeah, unless right there's, like, someone right the there. Single banana peel, and I'm just gonna throw it right over to the grass. And, oh, it, also, if you get a power, you can press the up button really fast, and then... Right as you're about to spin. spin out. He'll, do, he'll spin slightly, and then do a little, like, what flourish thing, I don't know. And he won't spin out. Ooh. He won't completely lose speed. You'll lose a little speed, but you won't lose speed entirely. Well, if you ha if have a power block. Shake the remote and we wheel this also shake the remote really fast. Bang! So that's what you do. And usually if I get a green shell, you, you never use it for ammo because it goes bouncing everywhere. So you honestly Yeah, just, and it might hit yourself. You just hold it behind you and stuff. Unless and it might hit you. Block, I'll just throw that right now. Just throw this where you... Yeet. I actually <laughs> threw it into the ocean, but I meant well, to it's throw it somewhere useless. where people could be. Well, it's kind of useless also, anyways. Also, you can do different tricks, directional tricks. I press left and, don't, and Funky Kong did a little flip instead of, like, sticking his leg out or whatever. You can also do mini Whoop. turbos on areas that aren't really, like, turns. Like, right now I'm doing that, and it's not really a turn. You can just do it to gain speed if you turn. want. You know, right Peach now, Gardens is also to good to demonstrate. Peach, Gar Peach Gardens, it's a really good one to demonstrate. Well, I, I selected with random, so it's going to oh. be four random courses. Well, I hope it's that one. Or well, maybe. Coconut There's, Mall, maybe. Or well, Coconut Mall is and also I, good to demonstrate. If I get a chance to demonstrate, like, grabbing a mushroom, and then a blue shell is coming for you, at the correct time, you can do a blue shell dodge. Also on um, N64 DK's Jungle Parkway, you can I don't do remember that one. Because there's like this ramp, and it's not like this ramp, it's a little different. It's this big ramp area where you go really fast over it and like take a big jump. And a blue shell will just stop right there and it will just not hit you or whatever. Pang! Face of a successful boy. My, you looked sad. <laughs> Look at it! <clears throat> That's what I do for success. Not really. I did My that God. I'm a freaking weirdo. Well, that's not too much of a surprise to learn. <laughs> Bye. Bye. But anyway, yeah, I guess we're doing GameCube Network Mario Circuit. I guess we're doing that next. But anyway, just right now, after two, hold the button and you'll do the, the boost. If you do it too late or too soon, then you'll get burnout. If you do it for too long, you'll get no boost. And you'll well, actually you do it spin too out. Long, you'll get a spin out. out. Which you'll lose. I just smacked the chain chomp. I, well, that's right good now, turn. I'm doing a standstill mini turbo because I smacked the chain chomp. But um, I'm sort of in like fifth place. If I get a mushroom, I won't really use it. If it's a single mushroom, I won't. But if it's triple mushrooms, then you'll use I, both. I'll use, I'll use two of them and then I'll hi hold on to one. Ah, you hit Mario just, you know, with it. Like CPU with a. Well, you literally block. threw but it directly in his path. Then I think you should hold on to one mushroom. 
you should use two mushrooms and then hold on to one. And also, yeah, right now I just got a thundercloud, so. And a pow! And I just did a pow dive, but I couldn't pass the thundercloud off to somebody else. He moves significantly slower when small, but I mean, well, yeah, there's l it's me. not very fast. Are, really bad. are you sure about that? Bowser, but I don't know what he's doing. Wiping his cold, hard ass. Yes, I guess he is. I thought. But your ass is made of cartilage, and Bowser's a bony boy, so I don't know. No, it's got some cartilage.